So Tristan and I are streaming live from QLS here in New Orleans, and we are super excited to announce DBT and Atlas partnership today. With a deep integration with DBT's newly announced semantic layer. So Tristan, I know the semantic layer is something that means a ton to you personally. Why? It's this long-standing vision of people in data to actually have some clarity around what metrics they should be using to describe different parts of their business. You know, we've all been in those meetings where uh, people end up having more conversations over the definition of a metric rather than the actual business question at hand. This is kind of like why we're super excited about the semantic layer as well, because the metric in some ways is the language of the business. Mm. So it basically connects the, la like now we finally have a way of connecting the language of the business to the data layer and the physical layer all the way up to like the source where, you know, the data is actually getting created in some ways that just wasn't meaningfully possible before. Along with that is the connection of the individual people involved in the data value chain. We've historically had data engineers and analytics engineers and data analysts, but here this this is really where you get the, the business people throughout the entire business involved in the in the real uh, data supply chain. You spent a ton of time thinking about just the metadata layer and the semantic layer. How are you thinking about that sort of just evolving for the community? Every time the modern data stack releases new capabilities, the value of metadata gets higher and higher. And an interactive platform that actually allows you to like, uh, parse through that metadata is, is ever more important. I think that we like are starting to have the ingredients that we need to make real progress on this. So, one last question. Something we like to think about at Atlan a lot is, what is the emotional value that's associated with products in some ways? And so I'm curious what your thoughts are on like, what is the emotional value for data teams with an Atlan DBT integration? Um, like I can go first, like mine is, trust and this like feeling of zen in some ways like you know these like in the before world there were like data brawls where like five people show up in a room and they go like how are we defining and we're recording revenue uh, and and it feels like you know like those 3 a.m calls like every data practitioner i've ever spoken to has gotten a call at some point saying something broke and we don't know why uh, and so you know this feeling of calm and zen uh, is, is the way I would, or those are the words I would associate with a partnership. So I agree with that. Um, I mean, maybe I would say that in the short term, where people have lived in this before world and we're trying to move towards this after world, maybe calm is the right near term emotion. As product creators, we are always trying to actually like make you forget that certain problems ever existed in the first place. And so uh, my goal here is to have people actually bored by this problem, like to forget that we even lived in this kind of crazy world that we, we live in today. Um, th that is really like what we've tried to do with DBT, because um, when you get bored of one problem because it's solved, then you can move on to other, other problems. I love that. <laughs> Boredom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here's to um, trust, then, and boredom <laughs> with the Atlan and DVD integration.